Linda, tell us what, I, I know you have been telling this many, many times, but once again, uh, tell us what happened. Yeah, um, I mean, I've understood now because of people saying like well, what Pierre's been said, and I've not been able to speak to Pierre just yet. Um, I mean, it was very close, so it's hard to say whose fault it is. Um, apparently he had damage, he was going to retire the car. I think if that's the case, he should have done, tried to do more to get out of the way for people racing. Um, but at the same time, maybe he was. Maybe he was, he just, the damage forced him to come across the track and, and then we touched. So uh, I think from my side, I was just very unlucky. Um, it's a shame that happens. Uh, I think we've had a great run of results in the last three weekends. Um, and I say in a good way or bad way, I don't think we missed out on too much. Maybe eighth or ninth could have been possible, but uh, that was all. So a few points would have been better than none, but, uh, but it wasn't today. So uh, hopefully next time in Barcelona, we can make up for it. Yeah. Uh, now, the first uh, race in Miami is behind us. Yeah. How, all, overall, the weekend, how was it for you? Um, very busy, stressful, but uh, it's been a great weekend, honestly. A good experience for everyone, I think. A lot of fun, very hot. And, uh, and sweaty, but um, yeah, amazing. I think amazing to see how many people are here, how many people turned up, and uh, the cheering and everything. You know, it's just a great atmosphere. So I look forward to next year already. Um, I think you can, you know, they can make improvements, they can make the racing better, they can make the track better, and, um, and then it can be uh, an even better weekend. So uh, I look forward to that. Thank you.